Hello and welcome to another video from RVZZ, get your RV on. And today we are taking a look at the Vintage Cruiser R19 RBS Crimson. As we're finding standard with these Vintage Cruiser units, the front is chock full of nice touches as well as the automatic front jack. Fantastic for easy loading and unloading or hitching and unhitching. We also have the nice uh, LP covers and then the diamond plate for that added security and protection as you're hauling, taking care of your investment. As we move along the outside, we have our obligatory under tow storage and plugins. I have to say too, I mean, this is just a sharp looking unit. I'm not sure if I can back up far enough for people to see. But uh, that is something that I like about the Crimson and also the Teal units that Vintage Cruiser makes. They look sharp. You'll find that this is a single axle, but there's nothing to, uh, to fear too much because there are four stabilizing jacks in the front and the rear, and so that way you never have to worry about it. Otherwise, it does have those traditional touches by Gulfstream of the moon rims and the white wall tires. So we make our way around the back. Some more standard touches by Gulfstream Vintage Cruiser. You have the nice LED lighting up top, as well as your backup camera prep. Although it doesn't come with a backup camera, since it's prepped for it, it will reduce your install time as well as cost. So that's a really nice touch there for those of you that would like to get a few amenities added on that we can absolutely take care of. As you prepare to head inside, you also take a look at the awning. And we'll approach the dual step entrance. And then before we do that, just to confirm that this is indeed the Gulfstream 19 RBS Vintage Cruiser Crimson. Okay, so let's hop in. You'll notice the composition or the floor plan on this unit is a little bit different from most because we're immediately greeted by the bed. A few touches worth pointing out though. One of which is I just I love this weathered oak look that we have inside of here. It gives a really it looks light and bright but still has a bit of that craftsman feel to it. We have the nice reading lights there, and then also your queen size bed. And if you've been in the uh, market for a vintage cruiser, something that's really nice is their signature bedding. Which, considering the fact that the vintage cruisers are sort of a homage to the 50s, a combination of 50 styling with 2018 technology. It's really nice that they have features like that onto the bedding and onto the pillows. It's that attention to detail that we really come to enjoy from both Gulfstream as well as the Vintage Cruiser. We also have some nice, looks like embroidered shades. Again, just <laughs> really cute, kind of nice touches that uh, you would hope for but don't necessarily find standard in a lot of the units to try to uh, pull off what the Vintage Cruiser does. So, facing from the bed back, you have a couple things I'd like to point out. There's your AC unit there, your skylight there, and this unit seems like it's aimed particularly at camping, either as a couple or on your own. That's because there's really not any separation other than this curtain from the rest of the unit. What you'll notice though is lots of opportunities for lighting, some really good storage space. And then we also have your uh, controls there for your awning and all your other things. And then your kitchen and such. So let's go take a look at that. Here we have our dinette, which does completely collapse. If you would like to make space for others to sleep or camp with you, um, it looks like this folds out into just about a full size bed, if not a little bit bigger, at least a little bit longer. We have our Bluetooth radio and such right there. And then across from that, we have our full swiveling TV mount, which might not seem like a big deal to you, but particularly considering the way that the bed is facing, it's nice that you can still lounge in your bed and have the TV face you. At least for us guys out there, I think that's a really nice feature. Um, we have our Greystone, I'd say mid-sized uh, microwave. I've definitely seen bigger. I'm not going to lie. I've seen bigger microwaves inside of these units. Or not in these units, but in other units. But I've also seen significantly smaller or no microwave. So with that in mind, you'll certainly be able to microwave more than just a hot pocket if you're uh, wanting to prepare some meals for yourself. 
Other than that, we also have other standard features that we tend to find with Gulfstream. We have our three burner stove and grill top so you can get your grill on. Your oven. Your dual sink with covers so that you still have some prep space. As well as, I believe this is a six cubic foot unit. It's a, it's a very healthy sized unit. Refrigerator. Let's take a look. Lots of storage space in there. You also have your plug-ins and such for all your entertainment right here, just below the TV station. And then before that, we come to the bathroom. So one of the things that is nice, um, you know, every floor plan has different advantages, but one of them that is nice is that if you are going to be doing all of your business at once and you prefer to not be bothered right so let's say you're getting ready in the morning and you need to do your first bit of business and then your second bit of business here in the shower and then your third bit of business here at the sink hello hello um, you have ample opportunity and space to do that at your own time and pace and so you can close the door Lots of storage for clothing, for towels, for other unmentionables, and you're, and you're good to go. More plugs. I'm not sure why you'd want to plug above the toilet, but hey, maybe you need an extra fan. Speaking of, not only do you have the skylight there above the shower, but you also have this automatic fan for, yes. <laughs> Alrighty make our way on out of here so again thank you for joining us for another video here at RVZZ get your RV on we've been taking a look at the vintage cruiser 19 RBS crimson by Gulfstream another unit with very tactful and stylish uh, look after the 50s combined with your 18th not good heavens not 18th century 21st century uh, technology. I was thinking 2018. Okay, so cut me some slack here. <laughs> Anyways, thank you for taking a look. We'll catch you later.